Hi guys and welcome back to the Bristol Prepper channel. So today guys we got a really really exciting one for you today. Um, at the start of the channel we did a video called 5 things I take to an SHTF. So today we're redoing that video just because I think it's really interesting as well because that led to multiple people doing their videos uh, showing me what they, they take. And it's really interesting, you know, it's been a year from then to see um, you know what, what, how a year has changed things and maybe your mindset or your gear has changed. So let's redo this. So um, let's do my five things. So number one, the first thing I take is something I didn't take last time, which is my beauty, which is my pride and joy, which is my uh, pipe hawk. So the reason I take my pipe hawk to an SHTF is because um, I've used it lots and lots of times now. Use it lots. Really reliable. Um, if the handle does break, easy to be replaced. Uh, just I can carve a handle to shape and uh, bang, it, bang it on there because it's only held in with friction. Um, the head never rusts. I've never had any problems with rust because of the patina on it. It's been really well protected. I find it really easy to sharp. The steel's really good, really easy to sharpen. Um, gets a great edge on it. Um, can be used for chopping, obviously light chopping and stuff like that. Now I'll not be going mad, I'm not be cutting trees down with it, but I'm gonna survive not like trying you know, to build a village. <laughs> obviously got the hammer pull on the end, really handy for hand hammering things in and breaking things up. It's got a good amount of length on it, so I can go two-handed or I can just choke up and do one-handed. I've um, got a lot of options, we've got a lot of options with this, you know, which is what I really like. It's one big fan of this. Uh, and obviously it's, I've put my own uh, love, care, and attention to it. Quick one about this one, guys. I want to name it. Um, if you can think of a cool name for it, we want a female name. It's not cool. So think of a cool fem female name we can name the, the Pipe Hawk, and we will do because this has become like a channel um, staple now, you know? Works really hard on it, and I always get out any opportunity. But yeah, this is <laughs> my first item I take for an Yeah. Let's go to the next one. What I never took last time would be my clean canteen because once we made a fire, obviously I can. Heat water up inside of here, uh, boil water to cleanse it and make sure it's clean. Uh, boiling is the only way you can be sure 100% is a is, um, all good to drink. Um, carries quite a lot of water for a size, you know, um, still, but still uh, packable, uh, still maneuverable. Got a good handy handle on the top, you can tie it up, place it hang it from trees, um, do whatever you need to do with it, really handy. And it's a beast, you know, it's stainless it's steel, you know. I've not had problems with denting or breaking or you know, leaking, it's just been an absolute tank. And I love this thing. It is a beauty. So this is my second item I take to an SHTF. Uh, next one is one I took before, but it is an obvious. It is my, I cannot pronounce this, so I'm going to destroy this name. Schmog, Schmag, this thing. You know, everybody's got one. <laughs> um, I take mine. Um, just because they're amazing, you know. So many options, so many different things you can do with it. I can't sit here and list everything, but the prime thing I'd be using it for is um, warmth and facial cover, and then obviously filtering water uh, if I have to take water from a stream and stuff like that. So I'd take this. And then uh, the next thing I'd take is my Condor Bush, bush Lore. This thing has been amazing, like a bit like the uh, Pipe Hulk. It's, uh, really never let me down it's been really good keeps an edge really nice holds an edge good um but but then quite easy to sharpen um because of that scandy grind is amazing hi guys sorry about that uh the little one's playing up tonight it's uh manic anyway yeah she was crying so i had to stop and carry on but yeah so like i said the condor bush lore amazing bit of kit uh definitely definitely take this it's an absolute beast i've used it so many times never let me down amazing bit of kit recommend you go buy one um yeah that's the fourth thing i take last thing i take obviously is a fire steel this is a one of the softer rods mishmel rod as you can see it's used it quite a bit um i have got a new one but i'm not sure it is so yeah i got this one but yeah take a, a fire steel just basically to make fire easy easy enough you know um and a basic need i think in a shtf situation uh you need fire that's just that's it Okay, so yeah, the fire steel. So the five things I take is my fire steel, condor bush uh, my schmog, schmag, whatever, my clean canteen, and my cold steel pipe hawk. 
these are my five things I take to an SHTF. So like I said guys, I'd love to see yours. So please guys, if you can make a VR video for me, a video response, it would be amazing to see everybody's um, VRs. So what, what you're gonna bring and stuff like that. So yeah, so guys, if you're uh, please willing, uh, make yourself a video and uh, leave it in the description, the link for your video. Um, I will make sure it doesn't go into spam, don't worry, I'll sort all that out. Just leave me a link downstairs uh, for your video or message me on Facebook or whatever, leave the link to it on my Facebook page, whatever you want to do. But yeah, just give me a shout once you've done it, it'd be cool, I'd like to see it. Anyway guys, thanks for watching today, hope you enjoyed it. I know it's not massively long, but we're just doing this five, five things and going back over uh, all my old videos and redoing them, all the ones I think can be redone. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. So if you want any of my t-shirts or jumpers, please give me a shout. Um, also guys, please if you've got five minutes, go down to the description and check my uh, link for our Facebook page. That's Bristol Prepper on Facebook, which is pretty cool. Go on there and check that out if you've got five minutes. Um, otherwise guys, as always, please like, share, comment and subscribe to this video. It massively helps my channel and I appreciate every one of you guys. Otherwise guys, as always, stay prepared and I'll catch you guys another day, another way.